So this is a beautiful detached house in Time Avenue, which is very central to Bourne. Uh, the Sainsbury's just round the corner and you can walk into the town centre from here. The property was built by David Wilson Homes and prior to being marketed has been redecorated right through. It has new carpets and there's no chain on it so it's available for immediate occupation. Just in front of the front door, there's the storm porch, which is a handy barrier against the elements whilst you search for your keys in the dry. As you enter the property, you've got a good hallway. And there's a downstairs cloak stroke WC. And at the end of the hallway, there's a large kitchen diner. So there's space at this end here for a table. And there are French doors which lead into the rear garden. And the kitchen's got a good range of units. You can see there's an eye level double oven, a gas hob with an extractor hood above. There's a China one and a half bowl sink unit and there's plumbing and space for a dishwasher, space for a fridge and over there there's space also for the freezer. So a really good size room at the rear of the house and off the kitchen there's a utility room with the boiler and a couple of units to match the kitchen. And the door there goes into the garage, so it's an internal door into the garage. And the door there leads to the side. So if we go back down the hallway, and then turn into the lounge, the lounge has got a nice feature bay window on the front. All the windows are PVC double glazed. And this one features the leaded lights as a nice effect. Got a living flame effect fire. And laminate floor. You can see there's French doors which lead through to the dining room. Let's take a look at this room from the other direction. There are fitted blinds at all the windows. And you hear, here you have the dining room, which is a good size room. You can see this table seat six, which just shows it is a, a good size dining room. So as we head upstairs, you'll have noted maybe that downstairs has all laminate flooring or ceramic tiling, depending on the rooms. But upstairs we've got carpets right through and they're new carpets. And this is the master bedroom. As we enter into the room, there's some wardrobes built in there on the left, on the right hand side. As we pan around, you can see there's also an additional range of wardrobes, which are built in. That's a good sized double bedroom. In fact, it's a large double bedroom. And then this room has an ensuite. So there's an ensuite double shower cubicle the low level WC and pedal stool wash hand basin. Go 
Got another good sized double bedroom here at the rear of the house. Again, this bedroom fits. So this bedroom also features fitted wardrobes, as you can see. All the walls have been recently repainted in magnolia paint with the gloss work attended to as well. So it's uh, absolutely immaculate. You just plonk your own furniture in and you're away. So this is another big bedroom, a little bit narrower than the one we've just been in, but longer. So square footage wise, very similar. And again, it has built-in wardrobes. So that's three out of the four bedrooms all have built-in wardrobes, which is good news. Then here, finally, we have the fourth bedroom. And that just returns round behind the doorway. So you would probably just about get a double bed in there, but it's really a, a large single. Cupboard on the left there houses the pressurized hot water cylinder. And then finally in the house, we've got the bathroom with a three piece suite and the bath has a shower attachment to the taps. So if we take a look outside, beautiful day to be looking at the garden, lovely sunny day today. So there's a patio area directly behind the kitchen diner. The remainder of the garden is mainly laid to lawn and it's fully enclosed. And alongside the property, the plot's a bit wider than the standard one. So you've got a utilities storage area here for your bins and what have you. And then the door that you can see just there leads back into the utility room. As we swing round, you can see it's a good driveway with parking for a number of vehicles. <laughs> 